hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel in today's episode i'm going to show you how we can create a hail storm using the unity particle system so let's get started start by creating a new particle system and rename it to hailstorm underscore particle system reset its transform and set the max particle size to three after that set the y position to 100 and uh, create a new material and rename it to hail underscore matte set the shader to legacy shader particles additive now we need a material for this so we'll go to photoshop create a new file this width and height will be 512 paint the background to black now on foreground select the brush tool soft one increase the size and reduce the opacity and this would be like this increase the opacity and do something like this with the razor reduce the opacity and do something like this Okay, hide the background and save it as a PNG. Hail PNG and save it. Okay, drag and drop this texture into Unity and select this, apply, and drag and drop it here. Okay, drop this material onto this particle system and this is it. Let's set some values, set the lifetime to six. Okay, and speed to zero. Start size to random between two constants, 0 0.5 and 1.5. Set the start rotation to random between two constants and the values will be minus 360 to 360 after that start color would be white with this much transparency and gravity would be 10 okay so our heel is falling as we can see so set the emission to 90 so set the shape to our box set its scale to a hundred and a hundred on Z looking much better check velocity over lifetime and set the orbital z to random between two constants and put the value of minus 0 0.01 to 0 0.01 okay also set random between two constant here on the linear and on x set the values to minus 20 to plus 20 the hill is very much windy so it's moving in random directions you can decrease the value of wind by decreasing this value you can select 10 or maybe 0 if you don't want any wind then check color over lifetime no not color over speed but color over lifetime add two keyframes here and set this one to 0 and this one to 0 Then check size by speed and this graph is fine don't change it then after that check collision and change this one to world dampen would be 0 0.2 bounce would be 
0.2 and uh, life loss would also be 0.2 okay radius scale is small you can reduce this much more small five okay so that's it this is how it will look while colliding so that's how you create a hailstorm effect using the unity particle system i hope you enjoyed the tutorial make sure to hit the like button and let me know in the comments what you would like to see next and uh, subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos we will see you in a new video goodbye